The date is July 8, 2019. Former Rank 1 player Vaxay just shattered the monumental 1000 PP barrier into a million pieces with a 1023 PP play on Reform's version of Tsukinami. Not even 24 hours later, 8 key comes in and yoinks Vaxay's top play with a new PP record of 1035 PP on Song's compilation. Over time, 1000 PP plays would become less common and more of Osu's highest ranked players would be able to get one. But what if I told you that on November 24th, 2020, a user was able to get 1k PP far below Osu's top 10. How far down is he? Top 50? Top 100? Top 300? How about 4,846? At the time of recording, there are exactly 38 1000 PP plays in Osu. 37 of them belong to the top 40. So how does someone with such a low rank manage to get 1k? Let's begin our story with the origin of Loki Chaos. Loki Chaos discovered Osu from when Roho got hosted by ESL with 200,000 viewers and started in March 2018. Most top players began their journey by playing casually for a few months with Mouse and just to enjoy the music. But Loki was like, you know, I'm going to skip all of the fun and go straight for improving. He bought a tablet in his first month of Osu and managed to pass a 7 star in 2 months. However, if you know anything about Loki Chaos, you'll know that he has one of the most controversial playstyles in Osu, as he's been falsely restricted twice and restricted once for actually cheating. Loki Chaos, or his name change XX Fortnite Pro XX, with a year into Osu, began going for first passes on maps like Road of Resistance, Palette Gamma, and Goodbye, all with easy double time. The first thing people started saying was that it's double tapped, it's mashed, and that they just don't care. And for Hidamari no Uta, the most popular double time farm map, it's not hard if you're able to mash. But not everyone can do maps like Pallet Gamma Easy DT, which is 405 BPM. It at least requires an insane amount of stamina and reading to be able to pass 11 or 12 star maps with this level of BPM. The community was heavily split against Loki Chaos, and the people who thought his mash plays were irrelevant became the majority, and yet, Despite all of the live plays he's created, and the willingness to prove that he's legit, staff decided to restrict him once again for the second time. This was the low point for XX Fortnite Pro XX. The whole community seemed to be against his playstyle, and every score of his that was score posted was quickly swept under the rug. Loki Chaos would quit Osu for a few months, and was looking to never return to Osu again. A wasted potential from a skill set that he was easily one of the best in. Suddenly though, out of nowhere, Around a month left to when he would get unrestricted from Peppy. He had a sudden urge to come back to Osu. He changed his resolution from 1280 by 1080 stretched to 1920 by 1080 native. He changed his area and began to work on more aspects of the game like aiming and accuracy. And after grinding away on some private servers, his skill peaked way ahead of his previous rank on Bancho and Peppy decided to yet again unrestrict him. He quickly rose through the rankings after his third on ban, but this time, instead of playing Rock Unlimitation with Easy DT, he went for an FC with only DT and Hidden. No easy. His first day on ban, he managed to get 775 PP on ROG. The only people who rivaled this score at the time was Rami and Emrak. Two top 10 players. It seemed like 1k was going to happen any day now, until one day, it looked like it was truly going to happen. A tragic slider break, and a new top play of 805 PP. Loki Chaos was so close to getting the score of his life. After countless retry, after countless slider break, it looked like he wouldn't be able to do it today. But then, finally, all of the stars aligned on his 912th try. What? No way. Is that one k Yes! <laughs> Yo, is anyone in chat? Oh my god. What? <laughs> some will marvel at how a 4 digit was able to get 1k, a score that not even some top 20 players have. Some will say that Rob is the next Hidamari, and that it requires no skill, and some are just here to enjoy the ride. What are your guys' opinion on Loki Chaos? Does he deserve a 1k, or is he just a masher with no skill? that doesn't deserve to be compared to the greats. Leave a comment below on what you think, and if you want to, leave a like and subscribe. Goodbye.
Put me in the Loki Osa documentary. Like, if whoever's making it, put me in it, dude. Take the sound bite. Loki is the greatest player, the greatest mashup to ever exist in this. Take that sound bite and put it in the video. Oh my god, wait! <laughs>